protests today from coast to coast against several new state laws severely limiting a woman's right to an abortion. One of the large rallies happening here in Fort Lauderdale, CBS 4's Hank Tester is there now live with a look. Hank. Well, more than 400 rallies were held coast to coast, one of them right here in Fort Lauderdale, fairly well attended. Let's take a look. When women's rights are under attack, what do we do? A spirited pro-choice rally in Fort Lauderdale. Over 150 show up at 5 in the afternoon. I definitely think there's an attack on women. What brought this crowd out? Eight states so far this year have passed laws limiting abortion rights. Five states have so-called heartbeat bills that ban abortions after six to eight weeks of pregnancy. Alabama's law bans all abortions unless the mother's life is threatened. All across the nation today, other groups are out saying stop the bans. This is insane. From our nation's capital to Los Angeles and even in the heartland of America, abortion rights advocates demonstrated against laws and restricting abortions. In Delray Beach, it was moms and kids in the street having their say. The same in Fort Lauderdale. I'm here because my rights matter, my body, it made, it's my choice to choose what I want to do with it. No one else can make that choice for me. Many in the Fort Lauderdale crowd believe the Alabama law is a setup to get the abortion issue in front of the Supreme Court. And there's Hal Allen. I want to prove that just all white men are not Neanderthal women hating people. Some of us support women's rights, and I'm one of them, and there are plenty others. Well, there's a brand new CBS News poll out tonight. 67% of Americans want the Supreme Court to keep Roe versus Wade as it is. 28% want it overturned. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News tonight. Back to you.